You can look at the miles. You're, that tells you, you can figure out pretty quick what something's going to sell for. John David, Joseph, Jed, and Jir, they were all along on this venture, the auction, trying to pick out a car. Ginger has been going to car auctions with my dad and brothers for a really long time. And so she's loved being in that environment, watching them buy cars and resell them and stuff. And so I'm not really surprised that she's kind of branching out in this way and wanting to do it herself. 82. Yeah, that's going to go high. That's going to go super high. That's, that's super it. low miles. I have never purchased a car of my own at a car auction. I've been here um, throughout the years with my brothers and my dad. Yeah, get you one of these, Ging. That's what you want. Pretty. Let's write this one down. This is... Awesome. Uh... And the mile's good, I guess, for this. When I saw the SUV, I was really excited because several of my friends had the exact same car, and it had been really reliable and didn't really need a lot of maintenance. So I knew it would be a dependable car. It's a C36. We'll look at that Alrighty. one. I think Ginger probably could get to the point where she'd be... I guess car savvy, if you will. This one here, this one here has lower miles, but I think it's been wrecked before. She's very, very wise. She won't just make a rash decision. She's willing to learn from others, and I think that's a great thing. On a lot of these vehicles, if they have this pin strap down them like this, that's a telltale sign that it's been wrecked usually. Or they it had another paint job done. They put these the pin stripes on there to help. It draws your attention away from the door lines. Oh, no. To help make it look like it's lined up. Man, getting an inside scoop here. Every family member in our family is unique in a way. We all have our strengths, our weaknesses, our things that, that, that just make us different. I definitely think Ginger has the most facial expressions of anybody I've ever met. Her big eyes, and she's like, when she gets embarrassed, she like rolls her eyes and things like that. Just, it's so fun. Out of all the ones in the family, Ginger is probably the one that's the most passionate about going down to the juvenile detention center and, and just investing in these young girls' lives that are there. And so out of all the Duggars, I would say Ginger's probably the one that's spent the most time in prison. Out of everyone in our family, Ginger is the only one that is left-handed. Ginger loves things fast-paced. She loves visiting big cities. I don't know, maybe it's just some of that, like going to the car auction, things going on all the time, right and left. Ginger has a interest in photography, and so and now that she's doing things with cars, um, marketing is one of the keys for selling a vehicle, and I think she's gonna do well with it.